today we're looking at the Nova Bolt VR glasses. These are kind of an entry level, cheapish set of glasses, but at, at this entry level, they're all pretty similar. Um, there are a few things I really like about these ones, and then a few things I wish they had. So let me just walk you few, through a few things. First, let me try them on. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. They're comfortable. Um, they got lots of nice padding here. It fits easily on your head. You can adjust it with these knobs on the side uh, that will do your eyes individually, or you can do the front back with this adjustment here. So that's pretty cool. Easy to adjust, pretty comfortable. Um, I don't know if you can really see this, but it's got the blue light for the eye lens. Now when you get it, I still actually have my lens cover still on. Um, they have this, this blue glass that will reflect the light from your phone, so it's better for your eyes. Um, so it's, it's, that's supposed to be really cool, I don't know, but it's nice that they put it in on an entry level VR headset. Now these are just the glasses. This is, doesn't come with any software or anything fancy. There is a, a, a code, a QR code that you can download, uh, go, go straight to the Novapult app. Um, but as a foreign company, they didn't have a lot of really neat stuff there. So you just want to go to your Apple store or your um, Google Play store and just search for VR apps. Um, when you get an app, so this is a roller coaster app, you'll see this is kind of like your normal cardboard thing. It will show you the two different eyes and then when you put it on the glasses, it puts them together, which is pretty cool. Um, most of the basic games that are free, um, especially on this headset, um, don't do a whole lot because there's no button on here, so you can't like interact with the game by pushing something to select it. Um, you have to select it by staring at it for a long time. So that's one of the downsides of this entry level uh, headset is you don't have that uh, button built in. Um, you can play the, the entry level games and my kids love it. They'll ride roller coasters or, or do some basic racing games. So there's a few games that you can do that are pretty cool. Um, it's kind of a fad I think right now. We're too early in the VR game to do anything especially fancy at this price point. But for 17, 18 bucks, this is about as good as it gets and it's, it's pretty fun. So you can try it out for a while. Um, and th there's nothing wrong with this headset. Um, it's not especially like hard grade, heavy grade materials or anything. Um, it's just your normal plastic encasement but it is comfortable, it works, it's easy to adjust. So for an entry level headset, you can't go wrong with this one. Uh, if you wanna pick one up, go ahead and click on the link below and it'll, it'll direct you to the Amazon page. All right, have fun.